So we have built a car object and we've got this car processor that creates car objects, but we haven't really talked about what objects are. Um, when, when you create an object like the car object, you have two things you give it. First, you give it properties. So we've got the year, the make, the model, we might have the color, the miles per gallon, and all those are uniquely identifying this particular object. But in addition to just the properties, an object can have behavior. So for instance, you can tell a car to drive, and then the car knows how to do that. You don't have to worry about how it drives, it just drives. Or you can tell the car to turn the lights on, or turn the lights off, or to brake. And we can also ask our car about itself. We can say, what kind of car are you? What is your make? What is your model? What is your year? And the car can tell us those things about itself. And that is the essence of what an object is. An object simply is a collection of properties that describe that object and behavior that allows that object to do things. And so our job in Java is to model the objects in the real world with objects in our code.